Hey guys, I'm Mike DeWitt, first degree black belt in 10th Planet Jiu Jitsu. This is a Superhero Jiu Jitsu Academy here in Springfield, Oregon. We offer kids classes starting at age four years old, go all the way up to 14 years old, and then we start in our adult classes with fundamentals. We've got our advanced classes, we've got morning classes from five to seven a.m. We've got evening classes, all different times of day. Uh, where we're learning how to defend ourselves, we're growing in respect for ourselves and uh, building our self-confidence and also um, getting stronger, faster, in better shape and, and learning how to uh, compete in, in this martial art as a sport. Uh, Tenth Planet Jiu-Jitsu is a no-gi based jiu-jitsu system. We like to clinch and bring everything in tight and, and focus on a style of jiu-jitsu that's very applicable for MMA, something where you're going to eliminate getting punched, but you're going to maximize submission attempts. I was starting to feel really lazy. I was laying around a lot and watching a lot of TV. I'm five foot six. I got up to over 210 pounds. Um, and one day I just decided I needed a change, needed to kind of step it up a little bit. I wrestled in high school and jiu-jitsu seemed like kind of a natural next step. I've been doing jiu-jitsu for four years under Mike DeWitt now. I'm a purple belt under him. My favorite thing about coming to Superhero Jiu-Jitsu Academy, all my best friends train here. I've made probably 25 really close friends just since I've been training here. Um, my group expanded from like three really close friends to easy 25 really close friends. I can count on them when I need them. Um, we all get along. It's a very close-knit group here. Uh, it's all laughs and fun and good hard work when we're in here. Uh, it's a great environment. My daughter loves it here. It's kind of just a natural thing, family gym. I never really felt comfortable um, in a group of people-oriented activity, and outside high school I found myself with a lot of anxiety, and um, I was bullied, I was harassed, and I, I didn't want to use a martial art to properly hurt someone, but I wanted to know the mindset of how to stop a situation if it ever got to that point. I wanted to have confidence in a situation if I ever felt uncomfortable. So I guess in the end of it all, I wanted to feel comfortable in uncomfortable situations. I'd say it's the environment alone that it brings. The environment itself is insane. I've been to a few other gyms and the environment here is just so much different. It's so comfortable. I felt so comfortable in an area where I shouldn't have felt comfortable. I'm starting into a brand new martial art and I've never done it before, but people are so welcoming and so new to want to just be like, hey, let's do this. Like, let's let's all learn together. It's not a macho thing. It's not a bravado thing. You kind of just got to go at your own pace and people understand that. Anybody, all ages, all classes, I think you should try it out. Have a good time, definitely. I started doing jiu-jitsu because I thought I would make more friends and keep learning. And what's your favorite thing about jiu-jitsu? Making friends. And have you made a lot of friends doing jiu-jitsu? Yeah. This is a good place to learn jiu-jitsu. Um, not only is it really physically challenging, um, it's helped me. I've lost 60 pounds over the last year and it's helped me, you know, as one of the activities that I've used to do that. I enjoy the, but the physical challenge of it and then the mental challenge. It, it makes it relaxing at the same time as getting a really good workout in. Sometimes it's still a little bit difficult to step on the mat. I have to kind of give myself a pep talk. Um, you know, sometimes as a woman you feel uncomfortable with whatever you're wearing or just figuring out what to do with the kids. You know, we're blessed to have a, a kid's area, but um, it's still hard sometimes. But after, once I'm on the mat, everything else throughout the day, it just kind of floats away and I'm able to process things and just get rid of my stresses. I feel so relaxed and calm after and it just it sets me up for a great day. I think it's paramount for self-defense, uh, especially as a woman. Almost all of the positions that you find yourself in jiu-jitsu, you're learning to overcome um, the worst of the situations and a lot of the time it's the positions that you would find yourself in. Uh, it's not enough to just learn what to do. You need to practice it with your body so that if you're in fight or flight, your muscle memory will help take over and you'll know what to do. I find that to be very important. It builds a lot of confidence. I find myself much more confident now and um, I'm more sure of you know my movements and throughout the day I just feel better. So to find out more, you can go to springfieldbjj.com. Uh, that's our website, you can come in and, and you can get a hold of us on our contact page there. You can visit us on Facebook, Superhero Jiu Jitsu Academy. Um, you can also find a 10th Planet School near you by going to 10thplanetjj.com forward slash locations. This is part of the video right now, Austin.
So it is part of the video right now? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, feel free to stop in and sit down on a class and just kind of experience the atmosphere that we have here, the family that we've built, and uh, you know, just understand that, that this is something that is, like I said, it's a family-oriented place and, and you should feel welcome as soon as you walk in. Um, I came out of... Ollie, we, we gotta, you gotta go over there, okay? You gotta go over there and talk to your mommy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry, let's restart that. Yeah.